Okay, let's take a look at a nice little Zippo that just arrived. Okay, now this one came in the uh, protective sleeve. And the only thing it says on it is Zippo logo. They're putting more of their boxes in these sleeves, which is a good idea. Here's the normal Zippo black box. And of course it was made, it's a genuine Zippo made in the USA. Also says Zippo logo. Made in Bradford, PA. Now this is on a black ice finish. I really like the uh, logo design. You can see it's high polish. Really takes fingerprints. And smudges. High polish finish. Black ice. Nice Zippo logo. And you can see it's got uh, flames, the little circle of flames. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight. Eight or nine circles of flames etched on the finish. Really good sound. Lights up nice. Now this one was made in... It looks like J of 16. J of 16. Pretty good stampings. This is a chrome plated Zippo. Chrome plated and they put that black ice finish on somehow. I don't know how they do it. But this is a really nice one. Let's do a drop test. <coughs> On this black ice. Okay, so it passes the lit drop test nicely. Now you can see back here is another black ice. Not as fancy as the new one, but just as shiny. And these black ice Zippos really take fingerprints. Smudges, you can see that got smudged already a little bit. And it'll scratch easy. But it's a good addition to my collection. Let's see how much this thing weighs. Somebody asked me that once before. Normal Zippo usually weighs approximately two well this one weighs two ounces so that is the high polish black ice zippo with the logo and the little etchings on it that's a nice one and definitely calls for some unlicensed cowbell Knuckle bomb.